Namaste. I am Yam Shiva Mahadeva of class 11 and uh, now I am going to explain about total internal reflection. Before going to the topic, total internal reflection, I am going to explain about refraction. When light travels from a denser medium uh, from ra to rarer medium, it bends away from normal. And when light travels from rarer medium to denser medium, it bends towards normal. Normal is a perpendicular line which is drawn uh, to the surface of the medium which separates uh, both uh, which separates both medium and uh, the main reason for refraction uh, is the main reason for refraction is the speed of light is different in different medium speed of light is different in air different in water different in uh, some other substance so the main reason is the speed of light is different in different medium and uh, now we are going to the uh, going to see a total internal reflection and i am going to use water bottle a water bottle stand and a water container now, now i am going to fill water in this container okay now i have filled uh, water in this water bottle and uh, now i am going to show the uh, total internal reflection when i pass light through this side the light should come that way but uh, the light comes through the water and uh, I get the light in, in my palm. This is because when the light travels through uh, water, the surface, the, uh, the water surface, when uh, light travels, the light is traveling 90 degree. This light is traveling 90 degree, so it's uh, the angle of incidence is 90 degree. When the, if the angle of incidence is 90 degree, the angle of refraction should be more than 90 degree. So the water escapes through this uh, hole and uh, the water water undergoes the water undergoes uh, multiple reflection. Multiple reflection of uh, uh, light means the light goes to the top and comes this way, this way, this way, and uh, finally I get my light in the palm. That is this this is known as total internal reflection. Thank you.